Continuing the PS4 3D450 saga, diagnosing and repairing it. What I've done, well, what we've done is we've ordered new Y main wards, that's new Y main installed, uh, and we've tested the X main, found it to be faulty, it's got a short between the sus output and the ground, so basically it's these electrodes and ground. The sus to vsus is good, and there's also a short ERC to uh, the sus output, which there shouldn't be. ERC is the energy recovery voltage, and on this set, the ERC signal, uh, or power signal, is chained between the boards. So what we want to do is verify the new wine main. We bought off eBay, which is about 13, 14 quid, so, you know, we uh, want to make sure we've got a good board. So, we'll do set up the oscilloscope. I've done this test already, but I'll show how I've done it. I've got 10x probe. We'll set the scope up on the trigger. It's a 40 volt trigger, single shot, and we'll do 100 volt per division. So everything out of the way. We're going to plug the chassis in. Get a click. Green lights on, and then we should see. Oh, no, nope, I've been using this. I think. Would help if I'm not stupid sometimes. Have to turn the scope on trigger. Plug it in. And we should see, yeah, we see a pulse. Turn it off, and I'll put the chassis set safe. And we see what we get basically if we zoom in here. We get a V setup ramp. So this is just it trying to prime the panel for it, ready to emit it, emit light. And we see some, uh, the start of a sustained phase. But the TV quickly aborts it because it detects the X main is not fun functioning properly. But since we see this wave, the Y main is almost certainly good. And the problem is also with the X main. Possibly when the Y main failed, it took out the X main, or maybe the X main failed and took out the Y main because of how they're chained. It is actually possible on this chassis for one board to kill another board. On the older sets where they ran separately, it was not possible for one board to kill the other. But that is the joy of making them cheaper. Luckily, the X main is generally quite cheap. It's about ten quid or something. So we'll all of that replace it, uh, and then we will see how it goes.